Hold up story, but this one with a definite twist. Could the mask man who robbed a scrap metal business at gunpoint Monday be the same man who walked into the same business about an hour later looking to sell scrap metal for cash? News 13's Crystal Gutierrez got her hands on the surveillance video. It was early Monday morning. Workers at this scrap metal shop in Santa Fe were going about their business thinking this would be a typical day. But they never expected this. As an employer restocked for the day, a man in a white mask rushes through the front door with a gun in hand, throws a bag at the worker, and demands cash. The worker quickly stuffs the bag with money. The robber then points to another section behind the counter. He seemed to know there was money there, too. The robber grabs the money-filled bag, points the gun at the worker one more time, and leaves. Police say there is no question this masked man has done this before. Because of his brazenness, he, this is an 8.30 in the morning at a very busy establishment. There's foot traffic. But that's not where the investigation ends. Police say the mask did not cover up his face that well. And an hour after this, an employee told detectives a similar looking man walked in to try and sell some metal but left without making the deal. Detectives say that's not the first time he's been at the shop. The owners believe that he had come in previous to this on, on Saturday. Here's the video of the man police want to talk to. Now, they don't know for sure if he has any connection to the robbery, but there is one thing for sure. They appear to be the same height. Police say whoever it was, they need to catch him and fast. We have to bring him in. Uh, will he do it again? We highly suspect that he will. Crystal Gutierrez, KRQE News 13. Police say the man in the surveillance video on Saturday did sell some scrap metal that day, and he did sign the paperwork for the transaction, but they do not believe that he used his real name.